program. We're going to take a quick 10 minute break after that. So we are on the class. Very exciting. Okay, so typically the classes run, the eight classes, counting tonight, are going to run in sort of the same order. So what we typically start out with is um, everybody comes in and, you know, hopefully gets here and gets done time. And we talk about current events, you know, what's happening in the world of landscape design, what's happening in some of the galleries around here, maybe there's an exhibit that you should go see, maybe there's an event like yesterday, the Bakersburg, uh, children I would see at Garden Museum, many of the pieces of art, it's just fabulous, and it was a tour, so things like that we would bring up to you, um, if we go to an exhibit and you want to tell us about it, um, if you read an article, such as uh, this month's this is, yeah, June Smithsonian has a fabulous article about a landscape designer named Mary Reynolds and all the wonderful things that she's doing in Ireland. So I'll mention things like that to you if I read them and you might be interested in reading them as well. Um, if you are looking for a job or you're working someplace and they need someone to do part-time work or if we have uh, a classmate call and say, you know, we need somebody to help with XYZ, we'll tell you if there are some job openings out there because we figure some of you may want some part-time work. Um, not landscape designing, but um, you know, something related. And you never know, or you might have something that you want us to know about. Um, you'll be doing work in your sketchbook every week. So with this many students in the class, Julie and I will both check your sketchbooks. We're not grading your sketchbooks. We're sketching. Sure. This is from last time. We're not We're just checking this time. your sketchbook. So you'll have a sketching assignment every week, and you don't have to show anybody but us, but we just want to make sure that you're continuing to work on your sketchbook. It's a great habit to get into, and if you didn't buy a sketchbook yet, there are actually a, a couple dozen uh, sketchbooks down there that probably they've taken the first couple pages out of. Just so, help yourself to a sketchbook. Yes, we are going to do uh, an example of it tonight, so I'm going to just grab one. Um, that's yours now. We'll just put our initials on it, whichever one of us looks at it. So when you come into class, if you get here a few minutes early and you want to show us, otherwise, sometime during the class, just make sure that you show us. Um, there will always be a lecture. So today, the lecture is just going to be going over how to use the tools. Um, this, can you stand up? Yeah, we can. So each week, there'll be a lecture. So next week, we're talking about um, a little bit more about scale drawings, how you put notes on your drawings. Um, if you look at the landscape graphic schedule. Um, and then we start getting more complicated. So there's these building blocks to learn how to do the drawing. Uh, let's see. There will be in class exercises the first couple weeks so that we can make sure that everybody's using the tools right and we'll come around and help you. Um, sometimes there are silly things like I can't sharpen my pencil because every time I put it in the sled holder, it's, I break the tip off. And so, you know, sometimes these are silly little things that we're going to do. Um, lots of lettering exercises, and there'll usually be a project, and there'll be a homework assignment that we'll review before before you leave. So if you have questions, um, we can answer them before you go bolting out the door. And it's a, it's a busy evening. Part of homework each time that there's a lettering, there's a sketching, and then there's data time. Right. So, so, and the reading. That's sort of an overview of the way we, we do the class each time. Except that, you know what we forgot to put on there? When you first walk in, we're going to pin up. Oh, yeah. So, we'll have that. so, so today we pinned up. So as you when you take your break, you can go look up in the back. But when we're going to have to, everybody's going to have to sort of pin up this way. But your homework assignment will pin up because part of design is having other people critique your work. So you have to develop a sort of tough skin and be nice to each other, but we'll positively critique your drawings and say, you know, that that is a little bit sloppy, or um, your lines are a little bit too light, or you didn't follow directions, or, you know, that looks fabulous. So. And that's what we're looking for, truly. Whatever we go home and make the first piece about lettering. Well, we're going to talk about taking lettering. Did you follow the guidelines? And did you put your guidelines on there? And so it's it, the critique is based on what you've already been exposed to. Right. Not they, we're not 
not judging your plant selections. We're not judging your um, your design choices. It's whether or not you're learning the graphics so that as you develop all these other things, you can put them on a piece of paper properly. That's sort of our goal. And we are way ahead of schedule. We are, oh, we're 11 minutes. 11 minutes ahead of schedule. Let's go with Friday. <laughs> the exercises we're going to do will take up some of that. Right. So, does anybody have any questions? Because we will take a 10 minute break so you can find the restroom, get a drink of water, have some blueberries in the back. Mm -hmm. Everybody good? Okay. 10 minutes. And you're welcome to look at the